riddle. What can it be? Riddles about past over. over. Long ago in Egypt, where parliament had so stand, a king was called a par pharaoh. Pharaoh. And he ruled a mighty land. The Jews were slaves of age for ages. Ages. They worked without a break until a man named Moses said it was a big mistake. He called on Pharaoh Ramses. Ramses. He said, let my people go. I celebrate their freedom. For at last they want. You know what holiday I am I? Do you know what holiday? Am I? I think it's a uh, Passover. Let's see if I'm right. Oh, I am right. Passover. The answer is Passover. Passover is a Jewish holiday that celebrates freedom in new life. When the Egyptian king wouldn't free the Jews, God had the Jews mark their doors with blood from a roasted lamb before sending ten plague as punishment. Then God passed over the mark houses without harming the, the people. Sea or the sea of what? Later, Moses led the Jews across the Mom, desert to freedom. The white seed of what? Um, All right. Uh, Read the question. Read the riddle. Any louder. Globe to find me. I'm sure that you're good. I was just east of Egypt. I'm a born in DC. In history, I'm famous. I'm sure you know it's true. And even true. Though? Though my name is what? My brother looks quite blue. What am I? What is it? It's a Red Sea. Is it the Red Sea? It's a Red Sea. Hmm, let's see. Whoa, we are right. It's the Red Sea or the Sea of Reeds. As the Jews left Egypt, Pharaoh's army chased them. When the Red Sea blocked the Jews, they felt all was lost. But a miracle happened when Mom. God parted the waters Mom. and the Jewish people Mom. walked across the dry land to freedom. I, I think this is Egypt. Oh, really? All right, Egypt. we'll see. Ask a the question, the riddle. And mighty nation, a proud and handful man. My story is filled with pharaohs. Pharaohs. My dad also would plant our ancient parliament on our green red sea. Oh, if you want to see them, just come and visit me. What am I? What is it? Egypt. Is it? Oh, yeah, because there's a lot. Of, there's pyramid in Egypt. That's where Egypt. you can find the pyramids in Egypt. Egypt. Egypt in ancient times. Egypt was a very powerful, rich country. Many Jews had moved to Egypt when it was ranges. hard to find food elsewhere. They lived there peacefully until Pharaoh Mom. took away their freedom and made them slaves. Pano right, read loud. Pano ranges, I think right, read the riddle loud. I was a king quite long ago in Egypt, my home state. When Moses came to talk with me, and said he couldn't wait. He told me I should free the sheep. Slaves. Slaves. How could I ever know? The things would get so awful when I didn't let them go. Who am I? Who am I? Who, who is that, Gina? I said it already. You didn't hear me. <gasps> it's Pharaoh Ramses. The Jewish leader Moses asked the Egyptian pharaoh Ramses to, to free the, the Jews while he was king. Ramses was had a new Egyptian capital and many great temples built. Okay. All right. 
They came to the land. They build. How in the world? Pharaoh. Pharaoh was land. We hopped on six legs and we flew. We spoiled the crops, and we just couldn't stop till one stop till we eaten the more cool and chill. What were we? What were? What is it? What? Oh, it's a locust. The ten plagues God sent down on the Egyptians were locust that ate the crops growing in the fields. Water that turned to blood, frogs, lice, wild beasts, Mom, castle diseases, boils, hail, darkness, and death. A seed through a Passover feast, I think. No. Okay. All right. Read to me the riddle. Second soup. Cups of wine. Mazabogs. Also find songs to sing. Time to play. Arms to hug. Watch to say. Claim a feast. Come and eat. Join the fun. Have a treat. Who am I? No. What am I? What is it? Is it I a festival? A cedar or pass over feast. I was right, Tama. Cedars are healed on the first two nights of Passover. Stop. Cedar means order, and everything is done in a special order at a cedar. During a cedar, the story of the Jews, freedom is told. Prayers Mom, are said, songs are sung, and can- good food is can- eaten. Can- it is a custom can- to invite to the cedar anyone who may feel alone on the holiday. Mom, I think this is candle. Candle. Really? Come on. Yes. We saw the cedar were warm and were bright. We shimmer and shine on the table at night. We stand very proud. What a wonderful sight. We told dancing shadows with, with glistening white. What are we? Yo, no, it's candle. What is it? Ah, oh, you're right. It's candles. Candles. Light, lighting the candles is the first thing to do at a cedar. A Usually, handle. the mother says a prayer as she Mom. lights two or more. Excuse me. I'm ready. Excuse me. This is a handle. Mother says a prayer as she lights two or more candles. The candles stay lit for the entire dinner and service. A handle. I'm a holiday book, as perhaps you will see at the Passover feast. Everybody reads me, but in here, all that I have to tell, and you'll learn the story. Passover, wow, what am I? What is it? Do you know? I told you, you always do. Oh, it's a hugged. A Haggadah is the book used at the Passover Cedar. Haggadah means telling in Hebrew. The book has stories, songs, prayers, and direction for the Passover service. I think that after this is Mazadah. Okay. I'm flat and I'm golden. I crunch you. I crunch? Crunch when you chew. I'm Passover blood. That is tasty and true. You may want to make bake on part of the feast. Add flour and water, but leave out the yeast. Yeast. What am I? Is it a bread? You're wrong. Oh! I guessed it. It's yes. a matzah. A matzah is a type of bread. When Pharaoh freed the Jews, they left quickly. Since there was no time to leave the raw dough rice, they simply took it with them. Later, the dough baked into flat sheets in the hot desert sun. Today, Jews eat only matzah or flatbread without yeast during the days of Passover. That's that dope. Next, 
I'm set out the table for a quite a special meal. I hold five ancient symbols that just may be ideal for the family said for at the family said so many look at to me. I help them to remember it's but one splendid splendid. To be free. What am I? What is it, Adina? I know. Oh! I did it! I did it! I did it! It's the cedar plate. The cedar plate holds five things. A roasted lamb. Bone stands for the lamb roasted on the night of the first Passover. A roasted egg and greens. Like parsley stained for spring when new life begins. Hold on, let me finish. Better herbs like horseradish stand for bitter slavery. Haroset, a mix of apples, nuts, cinnamon, and wine, looks like mor mortar the slaves use to hold bricks together. As to this thing, I think it's salt water. Oh, really? Yeah. Come in. You'll find me in the ocean. It's easy as can be. I'm what your tails are made of. Just taste me and you'll say, what am I? Oh, it's salty. Something oh, salty. Salty water. Oh, it's a salt water. I'm white. During the cedar, people usually taste salt water. This reminds them, this reminds them of the tears cried by slaves in Egypt. All right, this one. Spring. I think after this is spring. Okay. I come after winter, year after year, when new lambs and robins and young chicks appear. A time to start planting or building a nest on such a fine reason. See. Season. You may write me best. What am I? Is it summer? Oh, it's spring. I guessed it. You did it. <laughs> spring. Passover comes in the spring and celebrates freedom in the beginning of new life. The youngest child at the saddle, I think, okay. after this. I'm one of the many of many at the feast. The smallest you may say, but I ask for a big question. I am important as can be. I ask about the reasons that we celebrate every day. And why they are quite special in so very many ways. Who am I? Who is it? I know. <gasps> That's the youngest child at the cedar. At the cedar, the youngest child who is able... Ask the four questions. The four questions ask the reasons for the Passover holiday. The cedar leader answers by telling the story of how God helped the Jews out of slavery in Egypt and lead them to Israel. The African woman, I think, after. Okay. I'm one half of a mass. The. The. A game of hiding and seek. The leader gets to hide me. The children never peek. The leader, when they find me, the kids are always wise. They always keep me with them until they get a prize. Who am I? What am I? Do you know what it is? I know. Hmm, I think it's a hide and seek. Maybe it's a nut? Hmm. <laughs> Oh, I'm white. no. I'm white. Okay. That's the Afikuman. The Afikuman is half of a matzah that the leader hides. Later, when it is needed, the children search for it. When they find the Afikuman, they give it back. Only after they bargain Mom, for a price. I think. Wait. Afikuman is a Greek word that means scissors. It is the last food eaten at the cedar. I think you could cut cup after that. Okay. A beautiful cup. I'm always filled up for a wonderful 
part of the theater, how holding holiday wine. I walk ever so far, and I welcome a guest who comes later. What am I? I know. Yay! That's Elijah's cup. During the cedar, an extra cup is filled with wine for the prophet Elijah. A prophet is a very wise man of God. Elijah symbolizes hope and peace for the whole world. Near the end of the cedar, a door is open so that Elijah and peace may come in. Wow, you want to catch the 